How's it going, everyone? Brad Smith here with HealthLink, looking for the top health and fitness experts throughout the world. And I'm joined for the first time, my second guest, Coach Chris Cachera. How are you today, Chris? I'm doing good, Brad. It's always hey, a pleasure being here with you. Hey, you're the first one to have the second show with me. Oh, right on. Well, I might so be doing something right then, huh? <laughs> you're setting records, but you're also, you know, you also have these great businesses going on. And so I'm excited about to talk to you about this one. We did, we spoke about some other things in the last interview. So if anybody hasn't watched that, um, we'll make sure we post that first interview in the links. But today I want to talk about your uh, lifestyle business you have. And I know you just recently made some changes. So if you could just introduce yourself to the audience and then uh, what your business is. Great. Well, my name is Coach Chris Kuchera. I've been in the industry now, the health and fitness industry, for 38 years. So as an entrepreneur, I've had quite a few businesses in this arena. But my current company that I'm running right now is called MindFit Lifestyle. And what it is is it's a concierge service for people that are looking to enhance areas of their life. So we have health coaches, fitness trainers. We do meal prep, meal delivery. We take people on shopping tours, teach them how to eat properly. Um, we work, do corporate wellness. Uh, we even do some coaching consulting for uh, churches and ministries. So anybody that's out there looking to enhance their experience in health and fitness, uh, yeah. that's what my company offers, Brad. But specifically for me, those that are looking to really go to a, maybe another level personally or professionally, uh, the core of what I really do as a coach is help people master the relationship with themselves and, you know, inspire that vision, mission and passion that's inside of them. Uh, and when we get there, it's amazing to see what happens, you know, in their life, their health changes, their relationships change, their entire whole world changes. And, uh, you know, most people don't do that. They look at uh, an, an external result. What I've learned over the years is I'm going to go inside with somebody and really help them birth that vision, mission, and passion. And when we get there, it's just so cool to watch their life change. All right. This is a good time for me to read a testimonial then. Uh, Chris wanted to, uh, to let you know how much of a positive impact you've had on me um, from the first time I started with you and even today, outstanding coaching and just being you. Um, so this is from someone that says they're 35 years young. I think that... <laughs> I love reading the testimonials and how you're able to help help people. And it's cool that it's not just one thing you're helping with them with. You have many services that you can really, you know, help them. Now tell tell us real quick, is it just you running the show or do you have other people there helping you? Yeah, when it comes to the real uh, high achieving individuals that are looking for coaching, I handle that personally. But I have a team of people that I collaborate with, uh, the Brad. You know, not just one person can do any of this all on their own, you know? Yeah. So I've surrounded myself with like-minded individuals, medical doctors, chiropractors, healthcare professionals, coaches, personal trainers, uh, and, and the likes, everybody within that industry. So I can now, when somebody comes to me and says, Chris, I have a specific need, I can establish whether they're going to need to work with me or maybe they'll pass them on to somebody on my team that can better serve them and what they want. So I wanted to expand my uh, coaching business because, you know, I'm only one guy. I can only do yeah. so many coaching uh, sessions per day. And I want to really serve the community of people. And, uh, you know, after all these years, I've realized there's certain things that people need. So I believe now that the company that I'm running now, my lifestyle management company, has a service that everybody can take advantage of and a price point that's going to fit their budget. Well, that's great. And thank you for offering that because I know a lot of people could use it. But I want to touch real quick on the fact of hiring a coach and having a coach in your life. I think in the first interview, you told me about a coach that you had or a mentor. But what do you think the positives are of having a coach or a mentor to help you? Well, I think the biggest piece is the accountability, you know, is, is significant, especially for entrepreneurs or high achieving individuals that think that a lot of times they could do it on their own. And what I love about coaching is, you know, I've got a coach myself and I had a coach uh, when I first got started. And a lot of times we need someone to help us clarify what it is that we really want in, in life, you know, you know, and a good coach. Our job as a coach is to really get inside of the person's head and find out what makes them tick. 
You know, what is their passion, purpose? What is the vision that they have for their life? And it's sometimes very difficult to do that on our own. So a good coach, in my opinion, can help do that. And what I found over all the years, Brad, why I call my business MindFit is that everything starts right here, you know, in, in the head. You want to get healthy. You want better relationships. You want to reinvent yourself. You want to get in shape. Whatever it is, it all starts in the mind. And so right. what I do is I help people clarify that. And when we achieve that goal, it is just amazing to see the results that they get. And they get them quickly. And then, again, holding them accountable to what they say they want out of life. Yeah, definitely. I think, you know, just anyone watching your or looking at your website, reading the reviews and testimonials, you know, definitely it gets you motivated. Now, as a coach, is it all motivating and positivity um, to the people you work with? Or are you able to get in there and critique certain areas? Oh, yeah. No, I'm able to do a lot of the critiquing, too, and help them define things and, and work on areas in their life that they need to really focus on. You know, motivation's funny. Uh, you, you know, motivation only lasts for a certain amount of time. You know, the motivation could be while well, I'm on the phone, they need to be a little bit motivated. But what I want to do is help them dig deep so that they have an internal motivation. And that internal motivation, Brad, comes from clarity of purpose and passion and vision, you know. And so a lot of times they're going to come to me with certain areas that they want to work on. And I still go right back to that. Why are you doing it? You know, we, I really want to help them define the why, because when I do, then it helps tweak whatever path that they need to go on at that time, whether it be in their relationships, health, um, maybe they want to reinvent themselves, their career, whatever it is. Yeah. Now, there's certain issues that are coming up more often now. People are dealing with more stress, anxieties with work and life. Um, what's a service that you see most people think that they're coming to you for? Well, it's interesting. It always starts out with, you know, I need better health. <laughs> you know, maybe they. What does that mean? Shape, they're yeah. not feeling good. Their energy's uh, off. You, you know, it's easy to talk about health. And so, yeah. what ends up happening is as I start to unpack you know, what's going on in their life. Everybody's on what I call this treadmill of life that keeps going faster and faster and faster. They don't have time. And because of that, they're starting to, it's starting to affect their health. And so again, I bring them right back to, you know, why are you doing what you're doing? And, you know, because the goal, Brad, is to help people simplify their life, not speed it up. And a lot of times when they're on this treadmill of life is, it's not what they're, they're really running away from something. So if I stay busy, I don't have to look at what's really bothering. Me, okay. Right. Okay. And so, so I to help to, them. Yeah. So I want to really help them get to that core where they have that aha moment and they go, Oh my God, this is why I do what I do because we all have 24 hours in a day. And most people are working 15 to 18 hours a day on this treadmill. And still they're frustrated. They're not getting the results they want. Their health is deteriorating. And then when I really help them clarify their values and what's important to them and learn how to say no, all of a sudden that treadmill slows down and they start to look at all this extra time that they have in their life because nobody really ever helped them get clear on like maybe what their top five core values are. What makes them tick? And if you can help somebody manage their day based on their core values, all of a sudden we all have plenty of time. I think you just touched on a good point there. I think when people think about getting healthy and um, maybe getting fit, and then they think, oh, I have to reach out to the coach. I have to get on a diet. I have to work out more. Uh, that's probably the first thing that comes to somebody's mind. But what you just said is you actually help them save time and figure out a better plan for their life. So I think that's Absolutely. really unique. Absolutely. And, I, and, and, you know, as a society, everybody thinks go on a diet and go exercise. But look, nobody does that long term. There's a few of us that do it. We've made it our lifestyle, you know, guys like ourselves. But most people don't. And, and diets don't work at all, period, 100 percent. They never work long term. You know, so the key is, is to help people with lifestyle goals, things that they can do to manage their life for the rest of their life. And oh, by the way, when you do that, you're going to get healthy. You're going to stay in shape. You're going to stay in the gym or ex any kind of exercise, whatever it is that people are looking to do. You're going to make better choices with food because they know why they're doing it. A lot of people don't know why they want to be healthy. And if you don't know why you want to be healthy, 
then they don't stay healthy. <laughs> yeah. I want to read one more review because I, I love these, reading these. And I think it really goes a long way saying that everybody's different and you're able to adapt with them and help them. So I am forever grateful for the ways Coach Chris has helped me evolve since I started working with him in 2014. Um, I felt like it was never pre-scripted. Pre Instead, each time I met with the coach, I felt it was individualized and tailored around what I was going through. So I think that says a lot. You know, how difficult is it for you or is it difficult at all to deal with so many different types of people or different problems or different um, circumstances? Well, everything is customized. I don't have a canned coaching, you know, uh, pr program. And what I usually cool. want to do is meet the person. I have a very simple assessment that I have them fill out that are, is very well thought out to ask some specific questions so that I can really get into their head and, and clarify what it is that they're really looking for. And look, Brad, we're all the same. All of us want the same thing out of life. People want to be loved. They want to have great experiences. And, you know, so my job is to really, again, get inside their head and find out what makes them tick and really help them reach their full potential in life, whatever that is for them. You, you know, it, it's interesting when I look back over my career, when I first got into this industry in 1980, it's going to date me a little bit here. You know, I, I found my way into the gym and I and, and I used to think that I found the gym, but really the gym found me. And I wrote a book called Lessons from the Gym because I believe that the gym totally transformed my life, you, you know. And so my goal is like what I like to tell people is I want to help them find their gym. And that may not be a physical gym. That might be right, playing right. music. That might be traveling. That might be working with kids. It may be something else. But I want to help them find their gym. Because when we find that, man, that's what life's all about, is getting them to get clear on why they're here. You know, wh what are they doing on this planet? And really, when we connect those dots, Brad, everything works. All of a sudden, that program that they've tried to do in the gym or an eating program that's never worked for 30 years starts to work. The relationships are better. It gets easier. Yeah. You know, so that's why I don't put people on programs. They don't work. Yeah. Well, I think what you're doing is really unique. So how does somebody, um, if they're interested in looking for a coach or finding somebody as a mentor to help them, where's the best place for them to look? Is it just the people around them or should they, you know, really do a good search? You know, how can somebody find a good coach? Well, they should do a, a search and they should interview different people, you know, and uh, of course they can go to my website and, I, I give a 50 minute uh, consultation for free to see if, if I'm the right guy for them. And I may not be. And a lot of times I even refer them to other people, you know, but I would encourage them to look around, you know, get an idea of what it is that they are looking to achieve, do a search. You know, there's no better way to find good people than your own personal network. So everybody knows somebody that knows somebody, you know, and the best thing people should do is ask questions get really good at asking questions and talk to people, you know, who do you know? I'm looking for a coach or mentor to help me in this particular area. And they should interview four or five different people and see right. who resonates with them. And that's why I like doing these interviews so much. People can get to know you better, see your personality, see what you offer. And they, this is kind of their pre-interview process so they can see, you know, if they like, if they like working with you in the future. Yeah. Well, you know, what's interesting that I've found Brad in all these years of coaching people um, a very specific consistency in that all my clients share a very similar lifestyle and background that I've had my entire life. So there's no accidents. You, you yeah. know what I mean? I, I think people are connected with the right people at the right time for the right reason when they're ready. They're going to find exactly. the right coach and their right mentor. Okay, cool. So let's talk about, um, we're, we're going to make sure we post your website either above or below the link. Um, I think it's best if somebody watches this interview um, that they should set up a phone call with you. Um, yes. They can, you'll, you have that free 50 minute consultation. You can speak with them, see if you're a good fit, or if not, you can refer them to somebody in your network. So I think that's great. Now, what's that first 50 minute consultation like? What should somebody expect? Well, what my goal in that 50 minutes is to really find out what they're looking for. Listen to them. You know, they all come with some specific need. And so my goal, you know, we're not going to solve the world's problems in 50 minutes, but in that 50 minutes, I'm going to really have an idea of 
whether we're a good fit, they're going to have a really good idea of, of, of if I'm the right coach for them. And what again, what I'm really trying to establish is a clarity of what it is that they're really looking for and why they want it. And we can get that done in 50 minutes. You know, most people, no one's ever really helped them establish the why behind what they want. And so I want to try to establish that in that first 50 minutes is why is it that you want X? And that starts to get them really talking. And then we've got a foundation to work on. And then I lay out, you know, a, a specific program from them if they want to work with me and what that would look like. All right, cool. All right. Just just doing this interview, I'm ready to set up that consultation myself. Right on. It's always open for you, buddy. Mindfitlifestyle.com is the best place to go and read those reviews, read those testimonials. That's what I like to do first, personally, is see, you know, I get motivated reading other people's results. And I know that's what keeps you motivated, Coach Chris. So, you know, I want to encourage everyone watching just to check out the website, read those testimonials and set up that consultation with Chris. And I enjoy speaking with you every time. So I know everyone watching will enjoy speaking with you for those 50 minutes. Well, thanks, Brad. And I appreciate everything you're doing. You're making a huge difference out there in this community. And uh, we appreciate that. Yeah, well, thank you. And I want to encourage everyone watching just to live a healthier life. Uh, find a good coach, find a good mentor, no matter who it is. Um, you know, all the successful people, they've had mentors in the past. So if you can find somebody you can trust, and that's our goal is finding trusted businesses to connect with. So really use services like ours or um, to reach out to people like Chris. I think it could be a huge benefit. Um, so you don't waste your time and find somebody right away that you can trust. So thank you so much for joining me today, Chris. I appreciate it. And we'll see you guys on the next show. If you get a chance, watch our first interview. I'll make sure I post it in the links. And I hope everyone has a great day. Take care, Brad. Thanks, buddy. Thanks.